Hi guys, we're here for full throttle for a full body makeover. That's what April's theme is all about. Um, so we're gonna get started with our, huh? Full body makeover, makeover this somewhere or somewhere else. <laughs> See that, you heard what he said, he wants me to make it over. And people always ask me, like I have a magic pill or a magic wand where I can get rid of it. The way that you get rid of it is consistency like you're doing right now. Eating responsibly is what helps along with the exercises. Cause you're doing all of this hard work. I want you to be able to reap the benefits by being responsible. Not, not living, but just being responsible in the process. So we're gonna get started with our warm up. Um, for those of you at home, if you do have your elliptical and you do have a treadmill, my goal was to start off with warm up there first, just five minutes um, of, a, of a run, whatever speed is gonna get you into a consistent run for five minutes. But all of our treadmills and ellipticals are taken, so we're gonna do a separate uh, warm up. But I want you guys, if you have one, to actually use that and get into action. So we're gonna get started here. And it's up, four, five, rotate to the other side, same thing, back to the center, and walking it up. So that's our warm up, we have eight of those, if you're not going to be using the treadmill and the elliptical. That way the whole body wakes up rather quickly. So remember the modified version? I'm sorry. So for the modified version, same thing, arms go down. Except this side angle stays and we lift. So modified. No modified. No modified. Okay guys, let's go ahead and get into action. That wakes you up real quick, right? Yeah, I woke up. <sighs> Side.
Remember, if you have to modify, modify. or has had an injury. So of course the body is going to naturally compensate for those things. Do what your body is asking you to do without compromising form. So if you do have to modify one side, then that makes sense. Modify on that side, but don't do it to both sides. The other side that you're modifying will get stronger even with the modification. So don't feel pressure.
You should be good and warm and ready for us to get into the meat and potatoes of our full throttle. So we're gonna bring your weights in, your yellows and your blues, and we're coming to the other room. So you guys, you should have your three pounders or your five pounders. I'm okay with either. Awesome, you won't need them for the first set so you can just leave them up here. Okay guys, remember we had our couch or we had a chair, we had something that was um, just right, right above our knee line so that we can make sure that we can be able to sit and challenge our body. So you want to sit maybe a foot, a foot away from whatever surface you're on. The one leg you're going to start with is going to be up and you're going to sit back and we're going to stay. Find your balance. If you have to put it back down to reset, that's fine. But the goal is for 30 seconds. We're going to in action, sitting and standing, single leg. Rest for a little bit, reset, and we do the same thing to the other side. 30 seconds worth on one leg. At first we do one, one okay, one leg. Yes, one leg. So we're gonna step up one leg. foot above, leg. just so you're at least a foot away, perfect, perfect. Good. Good job, guys. Feel free to lower your arms when you sit. And down. Oh, good. Feel that stretch in that leg, that standing leg, completely straight. Good. Almost there. Five. Four. Three. Two, and one. Good job. Okay, we're going to switch to the other leg. You always notice one side is slightly stronger than the other. Arms go down when you sit down. Keep that leg up, straight, completely straight, the standing leg, good. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. <laughs> I'm trying to see which one I fit last. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, let me flip it around. It is for now. I was in February. You can see me, it's super dark in here today. Okay, so we're gonna be going for single leg hops. 30 seconds, one leg. No rest between. 30 seconds, other leg. If that's as high as your knee can go, that's fine. I would rather it be a high knee. That's the real good. You can get your knee up higher. That's my goal for you. 30 seconds per leg. And then we get to combine it. Combine it? Well, not now. But you're just going to do 30 seconds. Legs, leg hops, and we'll combine the leg hop and the sits. Same place. Good. And the knee, the bent knee. 
you're on the balls of your feet, Gary, it'll be easier instead of the full foot. So stay on the balls. Stand up straight, don't bounce, crunch your back. Switch legs. See how straight your body is now? Stay just as straight. If you have to put your hand on your hips, control your placement. Good, keep breathing. Almost there. So the bent leg is not moving, it's this leg. This one stays stable. Better, Marcella. Go. Somebody, somebody. I know. Three, two, and one. Good job. <laughs> We're waking them up. <laughs> See what she says? Sometimes you just realize you just activate certain parts of the body, which is like, ow, why is she touching on those today? They're already irritated. I'll turn the camera around and you'll be able to see them get in action. All right, grabbing our weights, guys. Remember, single leg, three seconds, and then we're gonna go into that same leg with our hops, no break. Standing. Remember, the weight is down when you're standing. When you sit, you raise it up. Don't let that other leg drop. Good. Remember the arm is down when you're standing. Opposite of what you want. Down. Good. Arm goes down, Gary. Foot not, not the foot though. <laughs> See, now this trick in the mind. Keep it going. Almost there. Five. Four. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good job. Go, going into your hop. Remember, there's no break between. Single leg hop. That same leg that was up is the same one that's bent. Bent forward. The same leg that was up like this, the same leg goes into bend. Bend that knee, bend that knee. Keep it going. Push. Straight up, Marisela. I know, I know. Almost there, we have five seconds. Two, and one. Good job, guys. Let me go get Carol.
but uh, I'm Leg. I think it's your right leg. That's up. Uh, the straight. Okay. Straight. Yeah, that's it. Keep that leg up as high as you can, Gary, even when you stand and even when you sit. There you go. Yes. That's where you're getting the strength. You're backwards. Arm goes up. Sit, sit when you, arm goes up when you sit. There you go. Sandy goes down. Up. Three. Two. And one. Now we'll go straight to our single leg hops. That same leg that was out straight is now bent forward. Raise it up, Gary, and hold it. Good job, Maricela. Good job. Good, keep it going. 10 more seconds. Three, two, two, and one. Good job, your rest. They did good. You got it good. Oh yeah, this is the fun part. All right, so let me borrow your weights. They're gonna be considered our anchor weights. <clears throat> what we wanna be able to do, we're gonna go into our squat front. So it's all in one, one motion. Okay? So we have 15 aside, we're focusing on. 15 aside. There's a squat on the in between. Then all three of these are one. Front, side, back, one. So we, we, are we squatting? Oh. Squat in between. So it's squat, front, squat, okay. side, Squat, back, one. Good. And I purposely don't have a wide squat. It's, I did that on purpose and caught me. All straight? No, same leg. Okay. So it's not that tight like this? No, you have it perfect. Oh. 
Good. I love they can demonstrate it so well. See the correction in his squat. He's corrected so that his knee is not going over his toe line. That's the importance of a squat. Uh, the it just wants you and just pulling you down even further, trying to maintain that and not lose it. Very good. Very good power move. Four guys. Yeah, they both went down the same time and splashed the jacket. 
there's a chance that the horse gets up there. Every time he looks at him, he's got his head down. Yeah, it was a lot of stretch in it. I'm doing the Kundalini yoga, so it's all. 
Are you off? Yes. As we start to frequently use certain parts of our body, we, we want to make sure that we are fueling it right. So he mentioned calcium and some other things that he just may want to take a look at as far as vitamins um, to ensure he has enough of that vitamin C vitamin D, um, as he's exercising his body. So take a look at that, listen to the signs and the feel of what your body tells you. And if anything feels off, message me let me know go to your doctor get it looked at because what we don't want to happen is we do overuse and then we injure it and you can't use it and it has to be in a cast so you know take it seriously good job 16 awesome you're ready on the floor work. let's see how many more she has are we doing? 
perfect timing. I love it when a plan works out. Yeah. Good job, Carol. Bring it up, job, Marcella. Go, Gary. He's going past his elbow. Is it three aside? I'm sorry, it's 20 aside and it's three sets. Don't confuse me. <laughs> you see how he tries to confuse me? I won't let him. 15, 15, 15, 15. Yeah, you're at core now, so we can do 20 aside with core. Good. You can rest between. You don't have to go straight into the next 20. Three sets. Three sets. Good. Does this hurt your uh, wrist, Gary? At all? Those knees up. Good. If you have to stop in between and jump right back in, even if you're in between, that is fine. Just jump right back in. the overhead that's the that's the complex playing it yes focus on the sounds around you drown it out How many sets? Three. three this is your last one are you on your last one Carol yeah. okay good <laughs> Last set. Go ahead and push it out. Good. Look at him go. Power through. Full body. Bring that knee up. Good. Push. Oh my. Oh my. Don't move your core when you come up, just move your legs. Good. Hydrate. Very good. What do we have next? No, sir. I wouldn't do that. I mean, <laughs> oh, that's good. Really I didn't do it again. You did? Before coming? Um, like an hour before. Okay, an hour before. I did an hour before. I also think I was being hurt. Yeah, you'd be nauseous. Yeah. 
Perfect. All right. It's me. So we're getting ready to do our next exercise. You guys be good? We have 20 of those. Touch. Open up, let them touch the ground. Up. There's no pause. Down. Up. Follow my tempo down. Up. Down. Up. Good. Oh, I'm sorry. They were doing so good. They were at my tempo. I stopped. Keep those legs straight, Gary. Is that tweaking your wrist at all, Gary? Going back like that. Don't be a man and try to push it. If it needs to be modified, let me know. Okay. Good. Go, Carol, go. I'm not counting. You guys are at a good tempo. How many are you supposed to do? 20. 20. Keep them straight. Force your legs to stay straight even when you come up, Gary. Yes! Yes. What about here, too? Like the muscles up here? That is if you know how sometimes I tell you not to fully extend yeah. when you're doing a curl? That's where that's coming from. So, so it's, it's like, like it's pulling it. It's yeah. It. Yes, it's stretching it. So that's why you keep a little bit of tension in there. Mm hmm. So Instead of hyper extending it. Yeah. Kind of it's like pulling it every time you do that. Right yeah. Telltale, I'm cheating. <laughs> actually, it's not even a cheat. It's actually making it harder for you. You could have to gain momentum every time. Unless I swing and you get mad because I'm moving my body. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to stabilize you. Have you said to those? That's why form is so important. Important. I hope you guys bring up these examples because they don't have me at home to be able to watch them as closely. So hyper extending, things are starting to feel weird and wrong. That means that there's something wrong with your form. <laughs> it's following you. <laughs> you need to following her. <laughs> Your thighs look great, Maricela. I can see the difference. Keep it coming. Push. But not for me, give me a pulse. 12, eight more. I don't know who you guys are following to motivate you, but pick one of the three here and follow them. Keep the tempo with them. Good. 
Good. Good breathing. Do you guys hear them breathing? That is breathing. What happened? to take her out the door. Our mat is done too. Stick a fork mat. It's like I'm done. Very good. We only have one more core exercise. Like you're in a bicep curl. Twenty aside. Keep that leg up. That leg is straight. The opposite leg is straight, Marcella. Yep. There you go, Carol. Keep that leg up. Don't let it bend down. Keep it going. Come up. Yeah. Cross over your knee. Good. Good job, Gary. Keep that leg up. Don't let it bend down. Uh, oh. Across your knee. Cross the knee. Yes. Twenty. Good. That makes a difference. Good. I'm great, guys. Don't just believe me. When it's heavy for you, Gary, lock your wrist. Good job, keep that foot pointed or flexed. Good. Good. Cross your knee, Maricela. Cross. Good. Knee aside, guys. Keep pushing. Sitting up. Good. That foot up, Carol. Good. I know. Almost there. What is the pulse? Are we at 15? 13. Good. Breathing. Every time you sit up, breathe out. Good. I know. Good. Way to push it, guys. <laughs> How's my feeling, guys? One has gone to Jamaica and the other one is on vacation at Disney with the kids, so. Yeah. I want to do more since I still Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, who doesn't want a Winston? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is? What in love? Yeah. Yeah. See, I never will win because I never will play. <laughs> Let's go on the stretch, guys. 
makeover guys i'll see you on front oops sorry see you on thursday see you thursday bye